Hey guys, it's Mike at Green Man Adventures. It's Saturday the 15th. We are out on a single night camp. You will recognize the tree in the background. This is the tree that I first swung from on my first hammock camp, which was Giant Seat Campsite. Um, the first ever video I posted up was from this place, so there's a little bit of a sentimental uh, feeling to the place, so I really like it. We heard, we were coming out camping anyway this weekend. We were gonna go over to a site in Keithley. But then Stephen told us that this was on uh, Great Northwest, uh, Northwest Manchester bushcraft meet. So at Giant Seat, and this is where me and Stephen met on our first and second group meets out here. Uh, so everybody decided, yes, sod it, we'll come here instead. It's a gorgeous little site, absolutely stunning. And behind us, you can see, hey, Dislock. Hey. Fantastic place. We've got Dislock with us, Woody's on his way down, he'll be here at about half ten. And then we've got Stephen coming down mid-morning, uh, maybe by lunchtime at the latest. So in the background you can see my tarp, he's just setting up his. I've just literally flown my tarp up because we've got a little bit of rain keep rolling over. Just to keep gear dry, there you go, dripping right on my forehead. Uh, so this is going to be a very chilled one. I don't think we're going to be doing much carving, but we'll see what happens along the way. And this is just going to be a nice chill weekend at the Northwest Manchester Bushcraft meet. Green Man Adventures represent. Yeah, it cut off the middle section, didn't it? Yeah, actually, that's doing really well, that tree. Is it still going? Yeah, last time we were out there. Here you go. I took, like I say, just so like people, little. If you go on the I'll Facebook down, page, down yeah. If you go on my Facebook page, and the YouTube channel, the Green Man, you know, the banner that's all the yeah. woodland, was taken. Just over there. It was taken on here. This was where it first came to my mind to put my adventures up on a video blog. Hey Woody, by the Hi. way, yeah, Woody's turned up. Hi. Like, we skipped all of that, but here's Woody. We did, and I was going to do a video on the way here, but I got lost. You got lost, so sat-nav was required, eh? See, it was required, and then phone was required. Yeah. But yeah, this we're is... We're just doing a little bit of uh, wood collecting so we can start a fire. So Get our amenities going, eh? Only just 12. It's only just 12, we have got lots of time left yet. Stephen should be here soon, I'd imagine. Right, so we've been down here, I've been down here twice previously, different times of the year, but I've never been at this time of the year. And why it's so new to us and why we're filming it is, you ready Woody? Mushrooms, Fly Garricks, I think. Nope, they're definitely Fly Garrick. Magic, magic, mushroom wood, magic, mushroom wood. Yeah. We the magic roundabout music going over there. Do 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 Well, we're kind of just sat chilling by the fire because we brought chairs because we're lazy. It's literally the only reason I did it because I couldn't be bothered, right? And you are going to go with the tripod method. I'm going to make my own. He's going to make his own. Why the shag not? Why the shag not? So that's your crossbeam, I'm guessing. Yep. Don't fire that at me. I'm I'll be not. well unhappy if that gets fired at me, mate. There you go. Yeah, legend. Right, I'm facing back up down here. I can see me falling. I can see Ooh. you falling in like two minutes. Um, Biscuit. Biscuit. Forage hope biscuits. Yourself. Honestly, help yourself. We've got some wild. We've got yeah, some wild caramel crisp here. Yeah. I just got him eating the plants. Oh, nice. The balsam. Oh yeah. That's something it's I like. It's edible. Too. Nice. The way they explode. Yeah. Like What's that? See what edibles there are. Yeah. Quite a few out there. Tony, I can tell you loads. Yeah. That's what I'd be interested in looking at. See what. Balsam. 
you eat the seeds, mm -hmm. obviously it stops it spreading. Everybody hates the stuff anyway. Yeah. But the spring when it grows, I, I think. Put it off, write it some more tricks this time. Just... <laughs> cool. Uh, stop filming me. I'm sorry? <laughs> stop filming me. Okay. <laughs> I'm on enough TV at the minute. Aye. Hey. Fine. I'm fucking serious, survival's got me on everything. Yeah. It's all right. Green Manx going to have you on one now as well. Mm -hmm. I am, I'm not officially a Manx. No, we know. <laughs> oh, <laughs> do not do that. <laughs> solid no, over there. Yeah. The red ones taste like Fly Garrick. <laughs> yeah. You've seen Mario. They you? taste like unicorns. Jump over the forest, just like Mario. <laughs> <laughs> do 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 and it's also been seasoned with jerk seasoning and uh, you did watch it. <laughs> Where did you get this chicken from? Paul's quality meats in Upper Milk. <laughs> <laughs> Where again? Paul's quality meats in Upper Milk. <laughs> the return of Paul's quality meats, boys and girls. Yes. Spider's been there. Did he get quality meats? He got quality meats. That's what you want from Paul's quality meats. That's what you need. This lock. It's on your head, be it, right? Yeah. If there's no video of the it's evening's... Oh, my fault, if there's no video of the evening's frivolities, yeah. it's this lock's fault, yeah. just so you know. No, it's completely mine, because I keep forgetting, whenever we sit down at night... Camp frivolity. Yeah, whenever we sit down at night, you know, to have a chill out and stuff, I always forget to record because I'm just enjoying everybody's company and I keep forgetting to just hit the record button. Right, so my duty now is just remind you. I'm going to say something funny in a minute, mate. Get your video on. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. There's a pheasant just running past. Yeah. It's alright, you've got time to get your camera out. <laughs> <laughs> you've got time to still be alive. You've got time to still be filmed, really. Paul's quality meat. Go on, go on. How long did this cook? Uh, how long has it been on, this one? About two, two hours. Two and a half hours. Yeah, easy. And it's gorgeous and perfect, look at that. Yes. In fact, I think if he won't complain, I might stick, oh, steal a, a leg off him. No, 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 no it's dead, so it's definitely not a pheasant. If it was a pheasant, yeah, it'd just be an empty right, bowl. Just, it's <laughs> just been empty. Get out, get some fish, seawater, you can camp it, you can fish in seawater. Yeah. Anywhere look, don't you? And, uh, and then the other side, you've got the fresh water to drink. You can self-sustain for quite a while. Yeah, you don't need a rod license or anything, a fishing license or anything for seawater. And you can use things like hand lines and things like that legally as well. Yeah. It's salty. Weird, isn't it? There's different rules. Yeah. But um, it's the good thing about it, it's a seven mile walk from the nearest road. Because oh. actually, if you go another three three mile down the road where I camp, well, there's actually a bruiser, or a bottle, or whatever you call it. Oh, but I don't, I don't bother with that. It's not bad. <laughs> there's too many people in the road. Did it have chunks in it? That was warm. It was warm. It said that was warm, mate. It could be nasty. That's not nice. Well, that, is that yours? I've been like this for about a year. Uh, or has it just gone, well, it's about half past eight, is it? Oh, uh, that looks pretty. Oh, it is getting dark early, though. Yeah. Because last week it was eight o'clock when it got dark. So it's about quarter to eight, it's getting dark now. Wow. You know. Tell you what, though. Oh. Genuinely don't mind. I don't mind. There's a woody in the woods. Woody in the woods. Woody in the woods, everybody. <laughs> Yeah. Use a poncho itself to keep a waterproof poncho itself to keep the wind off you. Yeah. And then just use that for warm. Yeah, you can buy a poncho liners. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah there aren't many poncho liners because they're pain in the arse. You know, a poncho liner should have a hole in the middle of it so you put your head through. So your front and your back keeps warm. Poncho liners are good for uh, under quilts for your hammock. I use a. Uh, um, <laughs> but have you uh, seen the new poncho liners? The new version. It's a poncho, a sleeping bag, and a jacket, all in one. Oh, nice. They look, like they're dear. <laughs> yeah. There's a lot, yeah. and, you, and you, you just don't get very far. Rolled across the window, There you go. Yeah. Easy way to get a you having a steak as well? Yeah. I tell you what, Morrison's do really well when we come camping. They get so many steaks sold. I think we've all got steaks from Morrison's. I think that's mine, then. Like that. yeah. I'm, I'm it's much more control over it. 
steak in my car. Isn't it plate. amazing how, how different timber gives off different heat? We, we oh, yeah. always end up saying this. Yeah. I've had campfires that have been like a quarter that size. Yeah. You know, like just a little fire like this for myself. And they've been that hot, I can't get that. I can't get both of them to cook on. Yeah. yeah. And I think, I don't know if it's Ash or Bunk. Elm, I'm not sure which one burns, but one of them burns so hot. Ash, ash just, is the one you can't breathe. Yeah. You, you just, but it's the heat. You just can't, you can't get close enough to it to cook on it. Yeah. And you both sat there laughing your heads off. Yeah, yeah big <laughs> beaming smiles on yeah. your face, isn't there? Well, what's good about it is beard. Spiders, because it's white. <laughs> <laughs> Because there is no colour to spider's beard. There were a lot of colour to spider. Well, to no, be fair, yeah. That, it was very monochrome. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm up for a few. Well, just brush, brush painted on yeah, stripes exactly. on them. Uh, go faster stripes down the it's side. Like the, yeah. uh, the B team. <laughs> it's a C plus team. <laughs> <laughs> So we've got, go on, what does shit Hannibal do? Uh, shit Hannibal? Yeah. He just sits back. For the C plus team. Back, pulls out his sack and just observes what's going on. Pulls out his sack. Pulls out his sit back. Pulls out his sack. Alright, oh, tell you Go on, what does shit face do? Shit face. Shit face, <laughs> yeah. shit face would probably have to make inappropriate comments at children's funerals. <laughs> yeah, okay. I like that. Appropriate sexual comments. Yeah. But Children's what does shit Murdoch do? Shit Murdoch. <laughs> <laughs> I have not got a clue. He's doing it. <laughs> <I don't know. laughs> yeah, that's pretty much it. Yeah. Yeah. He deliberately misses. Fences. No, he does that. <laughs> he down, deliberately he? can't hit yeah, shit. He also, yeah. he also deduces that the light in the distance is just the moonlight reflecting off the polytunnels. Yeah. yeah. Whereas I was thinking, fucking hell, there's someone over there. Oh, yeah. <laughs> can't see it now. Yeah. yeah. Whereas, what does shit be A do? I don't know what shit be A does. Well, you certainly don't pity the fool. Oh no. I do not fly, fool! I've got no do time fly, for a fool. You know, pity the fool. <laughs> I have no time for a fool. <laughs> Very well spoken, B. A. Baracus. <laughs> I have slight distaste and this person irks me. <laughs> that didn't sound like B. A. Baracus one bit. <laughs> See? C plus team. I think there we go. Oh, right, so it's half twelve, I think. One o'clock, maybe. I don't know. Either way, lay in the hammock now. Very relaxed. It's been fun. We've had a lot of silly conversations. Sorry. This is a little difficult, actually, guys. In this led. Oh, anyway, well done. That's what we've got. We're just going to stick to it. So yeah, I've got uh, it's been a great night, especially for one night we were. Um, we just didn't have the time uh, as a group to get out for more than one night. But when we did, we just went solid. We all just meet up and everyone went, yeah, let's get on it. So it's a case of just get out and have fun. And I tell you what, we've had such a good weekend and it's been a great catch up with everybody. And good to see everybody out again. It's been fun and... Uh, I'm going to try and get some sleep, and then get me a down, and I'll be uh, packing up in the morning to get ready to get back on the road. Nice early start, I think, so we can get some coffee and, uh, uh, you know, get something, some breakfast, and then get out of here, and then get back home and enjoy the weekend. Well, thank you very much, and I will see you in a wing morning. and a prayer, because my phone's on 7% battery. It's been a great weekend. Good weekend. Brilliant weekend. Good weekend. Nice, get home. Now uh, get ready to put this out for you guys. And hopefully we'll see you soon. If you leave comments, we like those. There's going to be a video here for you. Click on that and watch it. Just waste some time. This one here, yeah, right, it's going to take up most of this lock here. It's going to be really groovy. And then on this bit here, there's going to be a nice little logo. And if you press that little logo there, that'll take you to the channel so you can explore the channel. Anyway, enjoy.